Shame. Shame. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna move on. Okay, let's do the, let's do, let me do the introduction then. Okay, just a quick drink and we'll do the introduction. People on YouTube then actually have an introduction. They don't have to know the shitstorm that happened just before this. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Guys, don't tell anyone. Don't tell anyone the shitstorm that happened before this. No one ever needs to know. No one needs to know that we left the Germans behind. Okay? No one ever needs to know. It's a little secret between us. I like that Gabriel shouts out, I am the court rapist. I mean, is that something you want to shout out? I mean, like, if, if you're caught rapist, that means when you go to try to rape people, people know that you're raping them. So, don't you want to be secretive? Isn't that, wouldn't that be a better idea? I mean, not telling them would be the best thing to do. Uh, can you be one of my house guard, um, Lobzaro? Yes, of course you can, of course. Um, befriend around Martel, what are you drinking? Um, at the moment, because I need energy, I'm just drinking some uh, Mountain Dew, actually. That That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Just to give me some energy, but yeah. They need to know. Yes, they do, Sam Fisher. They need to know. Okay, everyone's got some weird positions and cause. I'm, I'm going to begin with the introduction then. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. <clears throat> Sorry, this, this, I, I do this before every time I stream, as you guys know. Okay, let's begin. Hey guys, and welcome. My name's NG Paradox, and welcome to our Sunday Small Council stream. <laughs> Sorry, I I'm reading the chat right now, but yeah, so, uh, <laughs> so everyone's reacting. <laughs> everyone's reacting to the noise I just made. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I I'm going I'm to leave that in. But yeah, if, if you don't know what's going on, guys, this is the Small Council stream. <laughs> People are probably asking if I'm on drugs at the moment. Um, but yeah, guys, basically, this is the. Sun I'm going to not look at the chat for now. This is the small council stream. This means every Sunday, usually, not for the next month, but this will be the last one for this month. I record every Sunday. I do a stream where I can obviously have you guys come and join me. And basically, you guys can give me advice and tips on how we should go about our business or our strategies or how maybe we should kill someone or something. And that means I can interact with you guys, which I really enjoy. And obviously, you guys can interact with me, which is great as well. So if you would like to join next time, please join us. Um, you'll usually see a video come up before I do it. That way you know on a Sunday. So yeah. But today we're going to be playing as a character a lot of people have asked me to do for a long time. We're going to be playing as the Lord Paramount, Tywin Lannister. Now, we're playing in the crowned stag scenario. This means that Robert Baratheon has just been made king and married my, my, my little girl, Cersei, 18 years old. And of course, our son is the uh, member of the King's Guard, which I'm not too happy with, that little bastard. He betrayed me and I'm left with this little... This little one, Tyrion, goddamn. But yeah, we're, we're going to play as him. I say it's going to be part roleplay, but part some advice from the chat. There's going to be kind of semi roleplay, but with the chat as well. So we're going to see what we can do. Um, people want me to play on this because they felt the other scenario is maybe a bit too easy for Tywin. In this scenario, we've got to come up with our own plan and develop our own way for what we want to do with things. But yeah, so we can see here. Thanks to my decisive action, Robert Baratheon now sits the Iron Throne in the place of the Mad King. Lannister men were the first to liberate King's Landing, and now my daughter Cersei is married to the king. House Lannister shall be great, of course. Now, we need to make some commanders, apparently, so I'm just going to go through the, the little things just before we begin. But yeah, um, apparently we don't need a commander. We just need bodyguards. Okay, well, I need to focus. Ha, huh, how about this? Okay, this will be this will be part for my small council. My small council. Convene, convene small council. What do you guys think I should do for my focus? What focus should Tywin Lannister have? Now, personally, you know, when I think of Tywin, I think of someone who's maybe a, you know, a family man, but he's a bit of an intriguer, um, maybe a ruler, a businessman, and possibly maybe a, maybe not a hunter, but maybe a war guy. What, what do people think? Someone's saying intrigue, um, someone's saying family. So we've got intrigue, family at the moment. Um, raise Tyrion to be your heir. Well, he is my heir. Seduction. <laughs> I, I kind of expected that some people were definitely going to choose seduction. So, uh, economy, um, intrigue, business, seduction, seduction, family. So definitely between um, intrigue, seduction, and family, it would seem. Definitely seems to be the one. Sedu <laughs> seduction looks like it's coming out on top at the moment. 
Um, as you guys might not know, actually, the chat is actually a, like a, a few seconds behind when I say things. So that does mean when I do ask some questions, sometimes it takes them a while to answer. But it's looking like seduction. Rulership. Okay, I'm going to go for seduction then. It does increase intrigue as well, I guess. Um, just arrived home. Who are you playing as today, Hugo? Hugo, as you can see, we're playing as Tywin. You've come just in time. We've literally just started. I'm glad you could join us. I'm glad you got here in time. But yeah, uh, we need an ambition then. What ambition shall we have? We have a lot of ambitions here. I guess we'd probably want to go with Obtain a Vlaire and Steel Sword. Because, you know, Tywin has always wanted one. As he said before, he's always tried to buy ones. So how about we go for that? Maybe we could find uh, Bright War, maybe at some point. I know I just completely missaid that. Now, we can't get married because we're widowed, so that's something we can't do. Uh, we need a Justice Seer. We could go for Torbert Pain. Torbert Pain. So here's my council right now. Let's get them to do stuff then. Improve Provinces. Uh, let's go for uh, Improve Provinces. Just go to... Oh, we got Castamere as well. I always forget that. Uh, fabricate claims, so descent, improve relations. Do I want to improve relations with anyone, or fabricate a claim, or so descent? I don't know. Does he like me? Well, Robert likes me. How about we just continue to do that then? We'll just get him to like us a bit more, I guess, for now. Um, train troops, train children. I guess he could go to try and train uh, Tyrion. Is he the best? He's only a. Okay, let's go for Tiger. Only 8%. Okay, I thought maybe he would have a higher one because he was a trained fighter, but apparently not. What about this guy? No, 9%. Okay, he's a bit more than the other guy, but Forley was the best. Yeah, let's go for that then. So go train Tywin, uh, Tyrion, sorry, not Tywin. Go train Tyrion to be a, a, a grand fighter, hopefully. Um, collect taxes, I guess money. Give us those monies. Um, scheme, make sure no one tries to kill us, I think would be a good idea. Then again, who would try and kill Tywin? <laughs> I ask you, who would dare to defy Tywin, of all people? Um, perform charity, someone said to marry Tyrion to Marjorie. That may be a good possibility, that would be a good ally to have. Uh, we'll leave them for now. Okay. And other than that, I think we've gone through all the stuff then. We just need to click this button, which I always forget the Why do I face the dragon? What? What is this? What 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 is this? <laughs> why is that there? I don't know why it's there. It's not normally there unless there's a dragon. So I don't know why it's uh, even there in the first place. Huh. Okay. We can't do it, but it's there for some reason. I'm not sure why. Oh well, maybe that's a new thing which I have not noticed for some reason. We have thirty-two thousand men. Who's the strongest in the Baratheon's realms? So I am the strongest. Then it goes the uh, the Reach, of course, then the Arrow. So the Reach is definitely one we wouldn't make allies with, most likely. So maybe Marjorie would be the best choice. And she is born, and she's just a quick and attractive. So that might be good. <laughs> Everyone's saying to face the dragon. We cannot face the dragon. It's uh, it, You can't click it, see? It's not actually an option. I'm not really sure why it's there. It must be some sort of bug or something. But yeah. Okay, well, let's continue then. Let's see what happens. Now, for now, obviously, there's not much we can do because... He's just become king. And Tyrion apparently has... <laughs> Tyrion has become a craven. He's not done so well. Um, I have been given a... I've been given Seneschal. Great. But I am the hand of the king. Excellent, excellent. So I am the hand of the king. What would happen if he dies? Hmm, we could try to kill Robert Baratheon after all. Or Stannis. Hmm. We could try to kill Stannis. I'm just going to look at some options for now. So we could marry Tyrion off to someone. Um, we also need to get Tyrion an education. But who do I want to educate him? How should I educate Tyrion? Should I make Tyrion into a strong warrior? Or should I educate him myself and make him good all around? What does my council think? That's what we're going to look at. My council. What should we do with Tyrion? How should we educate him? Should, we, should he be educated to be a grand fighter? Or should he be educated... To be more like myself. Should I educate him myself? People say myself, you, Kevin. I could send him to the, the King's Guard, guys. I could send him to be trained by, you know, Barristan. Barristan Salmi, you know, you know. Uh, intrigue or diplomacy, people are saying. Uh, Nugget Knight. Do you mean Onion Knight? <laughs> Warrior. Good all around. Get time to educate him yourself. Okay, it looks like people are saying I should educate him myself. Okay, you know, he is my heir after all, so it does make sense. I, I agree with that. Kevin is actually pretty good, though. I He's also quick, apparently. <clears throat> yeah. Sorry, I didn't know what's wrong with me. My voice was 
basically going, I'm going to have a quick drink, sorry. <clears throat> ah, apologize for that. You will educate him myself. Okay, that means then we need to think about what scheme should we set in place then? What does people think? Should we go for maybe the rock? Should we be going for independence? Should we try and take the iron throne myself? What does my small council think? I've convened my small council to ask for tactics or strategies. What is our goal here? What do we want to do? Barristan, yes. Someone said I should have done Barristan. You know what? He would have been pretty funny. It would have been pretty cool to get Tyrion educated by Barristan Selmy. I, I do love that idea. But what do people think I should go with? Uh, take the Riverlands. Independence. Definitely the Iron Throne. Tyrion for the Iron Throne. Put a Targaryen on the Iron That's an interesting one. Um, Ally the Reach. Take the Riverlands. Why do people say take the Riverlands? What is... <laughs> Why do people want me to take the Riverlands? I really don't see a thing there. King of the Rock. Kidnap Viserys. We could marry Daenerys, after all. Hmm, let's have a quick look. Let's have a quick look here. Let's go find Daenerys. I don't know why Elia Martell's picture has changed. Now she looks really fat and stuff. I thought she was meant to be attractive. She looks not attractive at all there. Um, Aegon. We don't want Aegon. Princess Daenerys. We could marry her to Tyrion. Hmm... Yeah, someone's saying Danny and Tyrion. I do like that idea. We could do that. That would give us a claim. So we could push her claim once they're married. And we could do that. Yes, yes, I, I got an idea. Then we can make allies for now. Then when we get the married, we'll put our plan into place. I've already got Cersei married to the current king, though. But they will not be Lannisters. They will not be Lannisters. This way, we'll have Lannisters. Okay, let's at least do the betrothal then for now. So it looks like a lot of people saying do it. Everyone's saying to do it. So we'll keep it like that for now, and we'll see what happens. Someone said no. <laughs> we'll see. Like I say, it's just a betrothal. We can always change it. But um, we have a lot of time to go. She is zero. I know she's zero years old. <laughs> but you've got to plan ahead, man. You've got to plan ahead when they're young. You've got to plan ahead, or they get nowhere in life. But yeah. All hail is grace. Robert of House Baratheon, King of the Andals and the Roina, and the First Men. Lord of the Seven Kingdoms, and Protector of the Realm. Long live the king. Now, I, I think I think um, Stannis might be a bit of trouble for us. I think we should kill Stannis. Who who in my who in my chat thinks we should get rid of Stannis? I think he could end up being a, a problem for us. I'm gonna quit. Look, who who in my chat thinks I should kill Stannis? Get rid of him. He could end up being a problem for us. He seems like a smart man. Killing Renly is not possible. Uh, killing Robert's not possible yet. But if we kill maybe Stannis, we might be able to get to him. Curse the Baratheons. Throw rock at Simon. Uh, kill Stannis. Blood for the blood god. Bet on Baratheons and Targaryens both. Exactly. We're, we're betting on both of them. <laughs> I like that. I like that one. Yes. Kill Stannis. Why not? <laughs> I like that. Stannis is stupid. He can't do shit. Okay. So th there seems to be a lot of people at the moment not liking on Stannis at the moment. Use 20 good men. That's all we need to assassinate Stannis. Okay. Looks like a lot of people seem we should get rid of him. He, I could imagine him becoming a problem for us in the future. Yeah. We'll get rid of him before he becomes a problem for us. Because we all know he'll be a problem. Okay, apparently we cannot get a dragon anymore. Which makes sense. Medium feudal taxes. Ignore for now. Okay. We'll see what happens. So who's helping us? Okay, the spy master of Dragonstone, Rampton, is actually helping us. His own spy master. Today my brother Garion asked me for a fief of his own to govern. So I could give Garion the reins of Castamir. Or Castle of Quebec. Which ones do I have right now? Okay, the Castle of Quebec. Okay, we have this little castle here in Castamir. Well, what does my small council think? Should I give my, my dear brother Garion? He's not married. 29 years old. Should I give him that small little castle? Someone said to seduce Stannis. We cannot seduce Stannis. I'm not a homosexual, sadly. Wait, why am I saying sadly? Why? Why? Oh my God! Can you imagine that? Can you imagine Tywin and Stannis together? That that is just an unholy matrimony. Oh my God! That is just that is. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, for putting that into your heads. I'm sorry. That's now in your heads. Now you can't get rid of that. There'll be fan fictions about that. Um, I think people are saying yes. Yeah, most people are saying yes. Kevin, yeah, Kevin, no, Kevin, you know, he kept Castamere himself. Um, Garen was always nice to Tyrion. Okay, here you go then. Congratulations, Garen. You get a nice little castle to live in. Uh, lower Crown Authority Faction. 
Prince Viserys faction, founded by Mace. Interesting, Mace. Why would you do such a thing? Why are you putting your money into Viserys? Why is this? He's ill at the moment, though, apparently. Poor little Viserys. He just wanted to be a king. He just wanted to hit what was rightfully his. Uh, and then that, that bitch Danny killed him. God damn her. She killed the rightful king. How dare she? How dare she? She's just as bad as the usurper's dog. She killed the rightful king, Viserys. We all know it. People just don't like to admit it. Um, and look, my other brother, Tiget Lannister, who's married to the Marbrand, he now also wants a place of his own to govern, but this time he wants Castamere. So we could give him Castamere. What does my small council think? How does my small council think? Do people in my small council think that I should give the you know Castamere to my other brother? I mean, you know, I don't need Casterman. He is a Lannister, you know. Maybe he should have some land. What do people think? People saying join Daenerys, um, join Mace. That's a good point. Maybe we could join Mace. Hmm. I'm not sure. No, he is unworthy. <laughs> a lot of people say no. People don't like her. Uh, people don't like Tiget. Oh, that's a shame. Poor Tiget. Oh well, you're not ready yet. I'll use my my keen diplomacy. Now we could we could join them. Um. He would like Tyrion to be educated by Stannis. That is hilarious. I'm going to decline that. That is amazing that he would suggest that. I love that. Okay, we can get some more people to join, but only 6%. 8%. Huh. 10% though. You know what? Let's pay for 10%. Send a gift. We'll pay for an extra 10%. That gives us a more likely chance. Uh, people apparently want me to seduce someone. Yeah, I don't know who to seduce, though. I mean, who can we seduce in our lands? That's, you know, someone I'd like to seduce. Let's have a quick look around. Can I, can I seduce anyone in the realm? I can't seduce anyone in the realm, not at least over there. It's located in King's Landing. Okay, so apparently because I'm in... Yeah, I'm in King's Landing, aren't I? So that means I have to... Can I seduce my daughter? <laughs> <laughs> but I just seduce someone in King's Landing. I don't know who's in King's Landing. Who's in the court then? Let's have a quick look. Any lovely young women eligible for me to marry or to seduce? We have a Martell here. We have uh, more Martells. Nope. Literally, there's actually literally no women apart from that one woman. That is it. Are you kidding me? She's not worthy to be my lover. God damn. Tywin deserves good lovers. Alassane is nothing. Yep. Okay, we're going to leave it for now. We're not going to seduce anyone for now, guys. God damn. You guys are obsessed with seducing. Every time. Every time. Every stream. People now say that's just to do Cersei. Uh, we're not going to seduce Cersei. No, so I could do the faction for Viserys. And by getting him in charge, we could then obviously uh, kill him. And then I'll put Danny on. But we need the marriage first. That's the thing. Um, we propose that Garth... The Gross and Marissa Lannister marry. So my cousin and Garth the Gross. Uh, yeah, sure, go on. Might as well. I don't see a problem with that. Um, but yeah, we'll let them get married. Twincest is Wincest. Of course it is. Now, hopefully Cersei gets pregnant. But will she get pregnant with a Robert's child? Or will she get pregnant with a, a brother's child? Ah, Jamie, you, you silly little Billy. My son Tyrion makes sure everyone gets exactly the same amount of whatever sweets the cook gives the children. I am proud of him. Time to explain how the world works. Hmm. Yeah, I'll explain to him how the world works. I don't think Tywin would think like that way. This is only about family, Tim. You only give your sweets to your family. That is it. That's all that matters. The legacy of the family. The dynasty. When we are long dead, the name Lannister will live on. So we do not matter. Remember that, Tyrion. Remember. Now, can I force him to train? We cannot force him to train, apparently. Why? Because he's now a craven, yeah. He turned into a craven, didn't he? God damn him. God damn you, Tyrion! Get Jamie out of the King's Guard. Hmm. I'm not sure how we could do that unless they've added some sort of, like, new plot. He wants to make me a commander. Fine, whatever. My son is it. My son is aiming for the stars, the ambitious little brat. Of course, that is only right. Tyrion is now ambitious. Of course he should be. Of course. He's the son of Tywin. He has to be ambitious. Um, but yeah. How are you doing, Ed? How is your bastard, Jon Snow? Ah, that is obviously your bastard and no one else's child. Of course, we all know that. Ah, little Jon Snow. He looks just like his father. Who's actually the lord on the wall? Lord Commander Jantos. Okay. 
And on the other side, we oh, okay, it's Denny's and probably Cotter Pike. Yeah, you got Young, Cotter Pike, and Malister. God, those two were commanders on the wall for a long time, to be honest. Um, but yeah. It's come to my attention, nobody's been designated as the regent. My brother, who I did not give that land, would like to be the regent. No. <laughs> He's really going to hate me. Kevin will be our regent, of course. Designated regent. There you go, Kevin. Congratulations. Married to a swift, of course.